so sorry you lost your baby. I know it must have been just awful for you. But it was. And even though I can't prove it, I always thought it was Alistair who made Julian abandon me when I told him that I was pregnant. Oh, God, Grace, I felt so alone during my pregnancy. I didn't have my baby's father to depend on or to comfort me when we lost our son. Eve, I think that you should tell TC the truth, that you should tell him your secret. He can comfort you, help you heal. No. TC would never understand, Grace. He would not understand. What wouldn't I understand, Eve? What's going on in here? What are you two talking about? Honey, you look upset. What is it you don't think I would understand? You know, Eve, anything you tell Grace, you can tell me. I will understand. I know that, honey. I know I shouldn't have said it that way. You see, we were just talking about Grace losing her baby and about how it takes a woman to really imagine that kind of loss. Yeah, it makes sense. Not that it isn't devastating for the father, but it's even worse for the mother. One moment you're carrying a little bundle of joy and hope and love, and the next moment you feel empty. You know, Grace, I am so sorry for your loss and your pain. I'm not just Sam's best friend, you know? I love you too, just as Eve does. And you know if there's anything either of us could do, just, just... Thank you, TC. I appreciate that. You know, babe, for a moment there, I thought you were keeping something from me. Why would you think that? I don't know. Maybe I should have my head examined. Forgive me? Of course. Mm. Ladies, I'll see you later. I gotta run. What? You know what, Eve. You should tell TC about the baby you lost. The baby that would have been yours and Julian's. TC is your husband, Eve. You should tell him about the son you lost. Grace, if it was anybody else's baby but Julian... It Craig doesn't I... matter. TC is your husband. He deserves the truth. Grace, you know what he would do. He would go crazy. He would probably even kill Julian. I can't, okay? I know that I should, but I can't. Just trust me, it's better this way. Oh, like it's better that Sam didn't tell me about his long-ago affair with Ivy? I wasn't trying to compare But the you have to. It's the same exact thing. Now, Sam claims that he thought he was doing right, and look where it's left us. I lost the baby I was carrying, and I don't know if I will ever be happy in my marriage again. Honey, you just have to oh, give okay. it Eve, we are talking about you here. Now, do you want to do to TC what Sam did to me? Does your marriage mean that little to you? Trust me. It did hurt me to find out about Sam and Ivy's affair. But it would have hurt a lot less if Sam had had the courage to tell me the truth himself. TC doesn't ever need to know. You are fooling yourself, Eve. Sooner or later, secrets like this always come out. Now make it sooner. And make it come from you. I don't want it to cost you and TC what it cost Sam and me. About my kids, Grace. You know, TC is not going to be the only one who can't accept my affair with Julian. My girls are going to feel betrayed. They're going to think that everything that I've ever told them is a lie. And I, I can't, I, I'm afraid to lose them. Eve, you have got to give the people you love more credit. They deserve a chance to try to understand. One thing I will never forgive Sam for is not trusting that I had the strength to handle the truth. But the situations, they're not the same, Grace. See, even if Sam didn't know it, he did have a baby with Ivy. And the baby that I had with Julian, he, he died right after he was born. So, you see, there is no baby to pop up out of the blue and expose my past with Julian. 
So no one ever has to know. What about Charity? What about her? But don't you remember those visions she had of you and Julian in a very compromising position? How could I forget? Don't you think it is possible that Charity has the power to see into the past like I can sometimes see into the future? Grace, I'm not trying to minimize anything that you or Charity sense, but I honestly don't think that's relevant. Because what Charity saw is just an odd coincidence, and that's all. Oh, Father, it's Eve. Oh. You just missed, uh... T.C. T yes, I know. I want to thank you for not mentioning me or Julian Crane or the baby that we lost. You told me that in confidence, Eve. But I really think you should tell him. I told her the same thing, Father. I can't. T.C. and my family mean everything to me. I have to go. believe that certain people possess extraordinary powers, don't you? Of course. I've witnessed too many examples not to. Were you referring to someone in particular? Yes, my niece. Do not give up hope on her yet, Grace. We are still praying for her rescue. I know, Father. And I won't. I was just thinking of some visions that she had a while back about... Eve and Julian Crane. Yes? Well, Eve thinks that they don't really mean anything, that it was just a coincidence, but I know from my own experience that it means much more than that. I would have to agree. What do you do when... when the visions you have are so horrifying that you can't even bear to think of them? That when you sense something awful is going to happen to you or your family or your loved ones and you are powerless to stop it. What do you do then, Father? There is only one thing you can do, my child. Pray. Pray for your friend Eve. <laughs>